Well, one of the newest of our programs being lined up for television has actually come to us from radio. It's the Dr. Bondolo Pandemonium Medicine Show. And the good doctor is alive, but I'm not sure he's well. Let's join Phil Reimer. Yeah. Okay. Hey, you know, the boss says uh, we got two college kids coming in uh, to the camp today. Summer replacements. College kids? Yeah, two of them. Honking college kids. Honking green behind the honking ears. Honk. Honk. <laughs> so, uh, what happened today up there on the honking ridge? What happened today up on the honking ridge? Yeah. You just say that? I just said that. Okay. That honkin' McDougal, eh? Oh, yeah. Son of a honk. <laughs> I got the honk damn Peavy jammed up in his big fur, eh? Yeah. And that honk face McDougal comes up in a honkin' cat. And then he starts pushing the honkin' logs down the honk damn hill while I'm standing on honkin' top of them. Honkin' honk hole? Honkin' honk hole is right. <clears throat> so what'd you do then? What I, so I jumped on the honking cat, and the honking dries it right in the forehead. <laughs> Just right in the forehead. Ah, yeah. oh, it's them college kids. Oh, jeez. Honking open, eh? Oh, hi, guys. Listen, I'm Daniel DiNostro, and this is my friend Phil Reimer. We've just come down on the crummy, and do you know the road isn't even paved? 40 miles of dust and bumps, dust and bumps, dust and bumps. <laughs> Phil almost lost his lunch, isn't that right? Yes, I did. <laughs> hi. Is, are these our bunks? No, these are ours. Oh, get away. <laughs> I want to stop this honking thing right stop now. Right okay, now. Stop it right now. Okay, Stop right now. We, as you can gather, are in the Dr. Bandola set right now, and everybody is here, and they are... <laughs> I love your work. <laughs> I knew this was going to I happen, folks. I love a big folks. man. <laughs> Bill Ryder, Bill Buck, Norman Groman, Marla Groper. And I said it right, didn't I, Marla? How do you put up with all of these? It hasn't been easy, believe me. Dr. Bandola, you're, you're rehearsing today, yep. and uh, how many more rehearsals, and when does it go on, and uh, everything about that? Uh, Norm, you take this one. <laughs> I don't know. All I know is we're getting 69 bucks for what? doing this. 69, I 69. I, ha I had mono. You, you, can, you can make more. I could, you I could, could be sick any minute. Just say anything you want. You can make more at Chum in Toronto That's than true. you could doing this. <laughs> Is this a repeat of the... Uh, <laughs> how much more? And then he goes, right? Then he leaves. So the only our show... I know. Phil, Phil, pay attention. Yeah. Pay okay. attention. Okay. Our show is going to be taped on Thursday night, August the 2nd, at the CBC Studios in Vancouver. And it's... October. What did I say? August. August. October. Happy birthday to me. Uh, October. Huh? October the 2nd. And then it'll be on the air Sunday night at 11.45 on October the 12th. <laughs> and it's every week, right? Week. The madness and an hour. continues it's an on. Hour. Tell me, with all the creative... Norman. What's going on out there? Settle down. We're trying to do a television. Well, with... if we were Bruno Gerussi, you wouldn't do this. <laughs> <laughs> Is Bruno Gerussi here? <laughs> Bill, with all the madness and all the creative people that are on the show, how do you really get anything done? That's what I'd like well, to Well, I just concentrate on doing the comedy stuff. And, uh, you know, <laughs> and... Uh, Hi, Phil. I used to be a weatherman. <laughs> Shows it seems yours. to work out okay. I mean, we had eight years on radio, and, uh, like, you know, um, now's our big chance, eh? Is it all brand new material? Are you going to recreate some of the better moments, the highlights oh, of radio? Yeah. Some, some of them, be, yeah. Some of them will be better moments. Any problems with the transformation? Everybody here has done television anyway. Yeah, I mean, this yeah. is not going to be a problem for you, is it? I think it's only because uh, they think that we're taking the radio show and putting it on television. In point of fact, we've all got a lot of television work. We've done right. a lot of television yeah. work. As Norm said, I'm the weatherman, right? He Norm, is, Norm he did is. nine years of BCTV weather. Uh, Norm was. He sent me a box of his old chalk. <laughs> did he? Yeah. It's in <laughs> He's helped Norm, you a lot. Norm Groman's Hall of Fame, and I got his chalk. <laughs> He's <laughs> helped you. That's right. So, we know what television's all about, and obviously, when we do the show, we're not doing a radio show. I'm getting angry right now. <laughs> <laughs> obviously, we're going to do a television show, and I don't care what you say. We are. And you over there. I, excuse me. Do you need an audience for the show? I knew this was what? going to happen. <laughs>
I think we're out of time. I hope we're out of time. Don Williams is the director and yeah. Jeff Groberman the producer. Right. And he's those two sort of coordinate all the zanies that are on the show, I gather. And if it doesn't work out, could I come and see you every once in a while in your little weather room? Hey, listen, I'll take your bike and go to Europe and you could do the weather. Hell of a lot more fun. That's it. The Dr. Bandola show. They're down here in the rehearsal studio. And by the way, we will be here until four o'clock. So the people will you be staying till four o'clock? Of course you will. For sixty nine dollars. Yeah. You have to stay. I'm going home, I'm going home to watch the Lone Ranger. Yeah. Do you know the Channel 13 has the Lone Ranger too? Like every Sunday, the Lone Ranger, they've got Sergeant Preston of the Yukon Whoa. and a Cisco Kid. It's great. I don't know what I'm doing here, really. Listen, the they're all on championship bowling all at the same time, right? Do you want to do this intro? You know what I'm supposed to say at this point? No. This is the newest show on CBC Television. From the newest, we go to the oldest. Okay. What are we going to introduce? I'll do it. This is the newest show on television, and from the newest show, we go to the old...